Welcome to the Tool Review Channel. Today we're taking a look at the Klein Tools 32476 5-in-1 um, multi-bit screwdriver. Now this is, like I said, a 5-in-1 screwdriver from Klein Tools. And like most of their screwdrivers that they have to offer, you have this nice rubberized handle. And as you can see right here, you have the Klein Tools name, which is stamped into that rubber handle, and it is super nice. This is probably one of the most comfortable handles um, for a screwdriver out there. And then you got this yellow um, uh, plastic resin, whatever they use, uh, that comes on most client tools as well. And then coming to the top of this screwdriver, you can see you have five in one. So if you have multiple uh, bit drivers or you know nut drivers in your bag, and you want to, you know, this is how you're gonna identify what tool is what, especially if the tool is facing like this in your bag. So obviously you can see right here, you have the five in one right there. And then you have a warning right here that, you know, always use eye protection and do not pry or chisel with this tool because you're most likely going to end up breaking the bits. They're not, you know, meant for that. And you have your product number right there, which is 32476. And you have another little warning down here. It's not insulated. It's not going to protect against electrical shocks. So don't go trying to use this on a live circuit or something that has the potential to come live or come live while you're working on it because uh, this is not going to protect you. You're going to destroy the tool and you are nine times out of 10 gonna get hurt yourself as well. So now, like I said, this tool is five in one. So I believe this is your number two Phillips right here. And then this is your quarter inch uh, slotted right there as well. And then you do have a 5 16 nut driver right there as well. And all that basically holds it in is the little bearing and it just holds it into place right there as well. And then you just swap sides uh, to get to your other uh, set of drivers, you have a I believe this is your 3 16 and then you flip this guy around and you have your number one Phillips right there, uh, which is nice. So this is overall, it's a pretty nice screwdriver. I wasn't originally planning on getting this screwdriver. Um, it just kind of happened. I was buying a bunch of Klein tools and the place, uh, Acme Tools is where I really originally got this from. They're running a promotion where if you spent over $100, you got this guy for free. Uh, so I decided to pick it up and, you know, you got some screws right here. It's overall, it's, you know, it's a nice little screwdriver to have. Uh, like I said, I've tested uh, quite a bit of their Klein multi-bit drivers here on the channel and they're you know they're all good they're all nice um the one thing i wish Klein would do is produce them in the usa instead of producing them overseas uh that's the one thing i do wish uh, Klein would do it but it obviously it has um quite a bit of purpose here as you can see it you know un undoes quite a few fasteners if you you know were messing with breakers and you want to tighten and loosen something before using a torque wrench um or a torque screwdriver i should say you know it's uh definitely a great little tool to have uh not really much else to say about this tool um it is nice it's kind kind nice kind quality as well and i believe it carries a lifetime warranty uh, as well i could be mistaken uh, but i believe it does carry a lifetime warranty against manufacturer defects um so obviously if you abuse the tool and destroy it client's not going to cover it but if something happens to the tool um, and it was a manufacturer defect, uh, you can definitely send it in for warranty and they should send you a replacement. Um, but that's kind of about it for uh, this review. It's going to be just a short, simple review. Not really much to go over with this multi-bit driver, especially since I've done the 8-in-1 and 11-in-1 and uh, before, and I've done some also um, some other brand ones as well. But that's all I have for this review. So if you are new to the channel and you want to see more content like this, please consider hitting that subscribe button. And if you did enjoy this video, please consider giving it a thumbs up as well. But as always, thank you for watching and stay tuned for the next video to be uploaded.